we are at uh, the prison set for the film, and uh, we're now we're set up for a uh, high fall coming over the second level, as well as we're setting up for a fire burn in the same shot. Uh, this is just as the riot begins in the in the show. Doug Chapman is uh, a Canadian coordinator, um, so he's been my my hands and eyes on the ground here in Vancouver. Fire jail has been around for forever. Uh, and there's some uh, guys who have developed a combination of their their own gel and fuel combination. But this is interesting because you can do it on bare skin, so it, uh, it, it adds another element. It became a two-stage process. The gel is the protective barrier. It looks clear. It looks like it's not even there almost, uh, depending on how tight the shot is, obviously. And then we pour fuel on it and light it up. It's really just a normal weekend activity for Doug. It has nothing to do with a burn. <laughs> Starts and crash day in prison. It's not a good week unless you burn at least a couple times. Prison inmates are going to be beating up some other guards, throwing another guard over top of the railing before I go, and we have to synchronize the timing for that before I actually go out and get lit up because we have to uh, make sure that the fuel is only on my body for a certain amount of time, otherwise it starts to uh, dilute, and then it won't go up as quick. So. If a paramedic is standing right here in the event that he needs any kind of attention. Stand by, guys. Here we go. Stand by! Are you ready? Yeah, it looked like it was on. That was awesome. One take, another one. It's all like that. Oh, yeah, it's pretty.